At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Preston North End up against Tottenham Hotspur. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. And the starting 11 for Preston North End. Well, in this shape, unless their wing-backs play further forward, there won't be any width in their attacks, which then puts a lot of pressure on the strikers to provide the goal threat. Introducing the Spurs starting 11. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Hume Min Son plays with Dejan Kulusevski out wide. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. And so the match is underway. Kyung Min Son. And a strong tackle. Well, no stopping him. Right here. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Fine work from Spurs to win it back. And he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. Javier and with that the attack fizzles out a creative look about this well tremendous block whatever way you look at that it's been squandered Tidy on the ball. No oh, mistake by the keeper. Woodburn. Well, making amends is all part of the game. Well, no wonder he looks relieved. That could have proved costly. Kane. Well, they have it again. McCann. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Well, as you can see, Spurs have completely controlled the possession. But with the talent they have on show here, the lack of quality in the attacking third has been a real disappointment. They need to play with more urgency to win this one. Well, certainly. And here they are passing the ball around once more. 
Very quick thinking there. A real opening now. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Playing it short. Up the corner, right on the back of the last one. It's a short one. to call that a squandered opportunity Stuart well what a waste that is it's far too easy for the keeper he should have made him work harder there and so it is the first half story has been written And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. McCann. Woodburn. And that's easy-peasy for the keeper. Harry Kane. Bentancourt. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Far from a good pass. Ben Woodburn Emil Rees Doherty has it Javier now Harry Kane and they continue to advance and a lot of options here Ben Woodburn determined defending intense pressure running with the ball confidently a fine reading of the situation Javier and the pass not quite accurate enough and a throw in then Spurs to make a personnel switch now and into the last 15 minutes of action effective challenge Daniel Johnson and given the situation, a goal at this stage might well turn out to be a winner. And he's won the ball. And continues his run. Firing it towards goal. And it's come off the keeper. Oh, a vital save. And it remains all even. Well, there you have it. He may just have saved his team here. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Who 
Who can he pick out? Clearance wasn't decisive. A good and fair challenge. And they do like to press whenever they can. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late, and he deserved a booking for that. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, tremendous block. order well he got his angles absolutely right what a good save that is well he's gone into the book well he was late and he deserved a booking for that
Well, the ball rolling again. No end to the action. It's the first period of extra time. And I must say, this has been a back-and-forth type of game. Bentancourt. Richarlison. And he stopped them in their tracks. Ivan Perisic. Possession ceded by Spurs. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Matt Doherty. Can they create something from here? Advantage, Spurs. And a good-looking ball. Simple catch, really. There will be one minute added on at the end. And the first period of extra time comes to an end. Still level here. It's a very attractive match in prospect. And it's Tottenham Hotspur who get things underway. Well, tremendous block. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Well, the drama continues to unfold. Second period of extra time now. Emerson. Richarlison. And Spurs doing well to win it back. On the attack, is there to be late excitement? Could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. Well, the teams are level, and every corner counts at this juncture. the short one and under pressure that was a fine claim in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here not testing the keeper at all with that effort and the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute a final that will live long in the memory. It's not finished yet because it's going to come down to a penalty shootout to settle the outcome. And the match is underway. 
Well, tremendous block. Order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. It could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. On the team. And this will test the mentality of any footballer. And that touched onto the woodwork. Can he get the better of the keeper? A chip from the spot and too much loft. And that penalty attempt well below average. And the keeper makes the all-important save. What a big moment. And off the top of the crossbar. Well, not an effort for his own personal scrapbook. A shocking miss. Can he remain calm? He scored in the bottom corner. So much pressure. If he fails to score, they lose. And he scores. A goal here to finish it. Not to be from the penalty spot. And the penalty converted down the middle. His turn to try to convert from the spot. And slotted home right into the bottom corner. Excellent penalty. And the keeper denies them from the spot. Well, this could be the one. Oh, that's it! The final act in the drama. One team jubilant, the other distraught. Well, what an end into a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment for everyone involved with the club, but for their opponents, it's a case of trying to forget and move on as quickly as possible. Well, I think we should give them some credit, too. They played their part in what was an excellent contest. Some of their football was brilliant. Yes, fair play, Stuart. The party in full swing now. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition. and so